everybody, it's Walt Kinney for Kia Country of Charleston. Got the trade of the week, a 2021 Genesis GV80. Give me a minute, we're about to get into this. Now this Genesis is all wheel drive. It's powered by a 3.5 liter V6. It produces 375 horsepower. Still able to get 23 miles to the gallon out on the highway. Okay, now here in the back, even with the third row of seats up, you can see that we have plenty of room for everyday cargoes like groceries and things like that. We've even got some storage underneath here. If we do find that we need more room for cargo, you've got a set of buttons right here. If we just give them a push, this third row will electronically lay down flat. That opens that much room up for cargo. If we find that we need even more room, you got two more buttons, you give them a push, that second row will now fold down and as you can see we've got full flat cargo area here to put a ton of stuff back here in the back okay guys now that we're in the interior the first thing you're going to notice you've got black leather throughout i know nothing about the history of this vehicle but i can tell you this whoever owned the vehicle they took care of it there's no marks in here there's no stains no funky smells it really is nice in here both these front seats are power they're also both heated and cooled. Your steering wheel's also heated. You've got power windows, power door locks. Both side mirrors are power. You do have memory seats here for the driver. Your steering wheel, you've got a power tilt and telescopic stalk. Auto on headlamps, intermittent wipers. So if you just set those, you can forget about them. On your steering wheel are most of the controls you're going to need to operate not only your telephone but also your cruise control and your infotainment system. To the left are all of your telephone controls including volume and your voice commands. To the right you've got your cruise control buttons and this is where you can set not only the speed but also the distance that you want to maintain and everything else from the traffic in front of you. Now on your dash, you've got an analog speedometer to the left. To the right, you've got your tachometer, and in the center, you've got a digital screen. Right now, I have it showing our lane keep assist, but I can put vehicle speed, uh, navigation system, cruise control, whatever we want to there in the center. You do have a push button start in this vehicle, so as long as you got the key in your pocket or purse, you just got to get it. Put your foot on the brake, hit the button, it'll start right up for you. It is a shifter knob here to put it in gear, and basically you've got the three that you need. Reverse, neutral, and drive, and then of course your park button. On your infotainment system, you can see that you do have built-in navigation. When we open up our menu, you'll see that this gives us our menu for our radio, media, our telephone, any connected services. Uh, things like that. We can even set this vehicle for valet mode. And with that, what we can do is we can punch in a code when we give the vehicle to a valet. That's going to limit how far this vehicle can travel, how fast this vehicle can travel, things like that. So we know that when we go out to eat or we give the vehicle to a valet, that they're not out there just beating on our vehicle. We have control of it. When we put it in reverse, you can see a great big backup camera comes up. And I've got a beautiful view of everything that's behind this vehicle, so I know we're safe before we decide to back up. If you notice here, we've also got an overhead view of the vehicle, and this allows me to look what's behind it, what's on both sides, and what's in front, so we know we're safe before we proceed. If we want to get a closer look at some stuff that may be around the vehicle, we can actually bring this up, and we can do a full 360 spin around this vehicle to make sure that we're safe before we ever proceed. As I know you can't see it with where I have the camera set up, but you've also got two sunroofs in this vehicle, one for the front passengers and one for your second row passengers. Well, there you go, guys. This Genesis GV80 is my trade of the week. You want to take a closer look at this? Maybe even take it for a test drive? Come by the dealership. They're at 2361 Savannah Highway right here in Charleston. If you can't make it over to the dealership, you can always go to charlestonkia.com. Got all the pictures, pricing information, list of equipment on this, and the other pre-owned vehicles that they have here in stock. Guys, if you like this video, just give it a little like. 
you may want to even subscribe to the channel. Each week I'm going to come over here, I'm going to pick a couple cars off the lot that I think are pretty cool and unique, do a video on them for you to enjoy. You never know, your next purchase might come from one of these videos. I hope so. Guys, once again, my name is Walt Kinney. I want to thank Kia Country of Charleston for allowing me to do these videos and say to y'all, bye.